Where are you? Where are you? All here for the big day out. The sold out Evan Road. Snap that gun! Come on, Sal. Get it done. There's only noise coming from one end and it's not the home. Watch out! Oh, Come on, Sal. Get in there. Don't get me wrong, it'd be nice to see them all celebrate like that with the offside, but this goal is coming for them. It is. Everything's going down Edward's side. That change has to be made soon. Or he's got to switch on one of the two. We know he's got a mistake in him. Ah! One time, get the press on now. One man. Yeah, get the long. Go on. Oh no! Get back! Give him far too much respect, man. We do. Yeah, this is it. One nil. They'll never celebrate like it ever again. The dream come true on the big day. Fuck's sake! We always give these teams respect, and we always pay the price. That play leads. Deserve lead. No way, man. No way. A special chant from all 20 of them. We don't deserve anything. These players, man. Embarrassing. A derby like that. Bang your heads in shame, man. Just walk through the room with 30 minutes in. Embarrassing. Oh my, this is going to be a rugby score, this. Here we go. Unmarked. Not a care in the world, finally. Yeah, this is them backwards. I knew this would come in, but not this bad. Oh. I'm trying to think of a time where I've been more embarrassed than I can't. This is shocking. Giving them the run of the pitch, do whatever they like. Yeah, this is straight. Wow. Oh my, this is going to be a 5 0 of this. This is shocking. Nichols has saved us. Nichols has saved us from fall. Not that it's any less embarrassing. Shout for handball. This first. Attempts at having anything in about, about half an hour really, apart from the birds all shot. Oh, I should have stayed in bed. Go on there! They don't care, they seriously don't. Passengers. Uh, it's 4 0 now, we're outside, I'll be honest, we've lost interest now. I haven't got a clue with a lot of them. No passion. No nothing. Fair play to Leeds have been dynamite, but we, you know, come have a jog. Not a care in the world away you go. You know what? I was just saying to just saying to one of my mates, like, you know, what, what does this mean for the, for the younger lot? I'm not going to want to get into Sporting Town, seeing this. 
Shock him. I'm filming. So I'm back now, it's the 55th minute because I really couldn't care less because I'm, I'm having the same attitude as our players and we've finally got a corner. Great. Is it going to be five? Fuck oh, me! No, it's not pressing him, not a care in the world! Oh, I've seen more threat in Huddersfield Town Centre. Oh, just, just, just having a laugh at that, aren't they? Four nils for the half time. Don't get me wrong guys, I expected to come here and lose. Like a steady 2-0, you know. Oh, we've had a couple of chances. We gave it as all, but we lost to a better team, which pays me to say it, they are. 4-0 at half time. Oh, they want to get roared at a lot of them, man. 4-0 in a derby. Not a care in the world. Jogging around, shocking. I'd like to say I'm shocked. But I'm really not. Because we've seen this on Tuesday night. Eight goals in two games, man, and not a goal scored. Crazy, man. I think five will be coming soon. Where's all, where's all the noise gone? I've seen some bad days with town, but I don't know. I think this might take the biscuit to be fair. I don't know why I'm still here, I'll be honest with you. Come on, oh, Sam. Come on, Sam. Well, first things first, uh, pain to say it, Leeds, that scoreline is generous. Leeds deserved about eight there. We were absolutely shocking, and the players should be embarrassing themselves. And yeah, I know. Like, like I say, throughout the video, I try to have the crap, obviously, with the Leeds fans, and you know, bit of, bit of games and that. But when it comes down to it, you guys deserved it and more. We were like a pub side. A couple of plays I've got time for at this club. Very few, even more so after today. Half of them need to go out straight out the door. Not a care in the world. And this is a, you know, this is a big game. Leeds fans probably won't admit for them. Half of them think it is, half of them don't. You know, whatever your opinion is, your opinion. For us, it is. It's a derby. It's another Yorkshire team. You know, show a bit of passion, like Oggy does. But not a care in the world. And you know, like I say, after it's what a lot of things for the younger generation. No one's going to want to come to these games. You know, with the cost going up and, and jogging, jogging around the field like mental. It's, you could have you could have had ten ten blokes in the smoking area giving more than what I've seen there today. It's an absolute joke, and you know we've conceded eight goals in two games now. They, and you know they're not fit to wear the shirt. I chanted in it. No shame. It's right. I'm, I'm sick to the back teeth now with sugarcoating it. That was embarrassing. Uh, embarrassing. I've had, a, I've had a quite a few to drink, to be fair. And, and rightly so. How else would I be able to stay in that? They want to be embarrassed, and I just can't get my head around how they think that, that jogging is okay. And You know, seeing it there at the end, you are jogging with the ball forward. And you just take, your man takes it off him. Like, like taking kid off, uh, candy off a kid. It's, it's blagged my head. Because I can't, I can't, I can get my head around the fact that we were going to lose today. 
and I knew we were going to lose today. Everyone in the ground did. But to lose like that and in that manner, you know, you got my cousin over from Ireland travelling for that. No shame. Anyway, look, Huddersfield fans, Leeds fans, we're all here for the same reason to have the crack and have a good time at the football. Enjoy your weekends, safe trip home, everyone, all the best. Leeds look like a team that could be going back up. We look like a team that's probably going to be up, down the bottom again. Same as again. But I don't think this manager, you know, I don't think he knows what he's doing. I don't. And a lot of the fans think the same. We haven't got the players, we haven't got the money, the right man in charge. May change, I may eat my words, and I'll humbly apologise when that day comes. But if it doesn't, I stand by it. That's just the game, isn't it? Anyway, all the best, everyone. Have a great weekend, and I'll, uh, I'll see you when we're getting uh, rattled by the next team. All the best.